Well, look at you. Turn yourself around, darling. Please do. Oh, don't be shy. I'm just your mama. Yes, turn yourself around. Show us. I No, I love it. I do. I do. I'm not giving any face. What face am I giving? It's beautiful. It, it truly is. I just... I just have my questions. That's all. Well, why did I spend five hundred for this dress to then customize it for another three hundred dollars for them to gut it, cut it, and take off ninety nine point nine percent of the fabric off? I, I, I just, I just don't understand. That, that's merely it. Mm. You want to stay ahead of the trends? This is what. This is what the girls are doing, okay. Well, no, I like it. I do, I do. I just, I have, I have scissors myself. I could have done this. No, I could have. I, I am nifty. I am crafty. I can do just about anything. I can. Just, no, don't ask daddy. He, he doesn't know what I do half the time. But I could have done this. I could have. No, I love it. it. It was worth every single penny. Which is why, and I know, darling, I know that you're mad. I know. But I just could not afford any more expenses for this prom. And I know that it's a big day. I get it. I get, I've been there. I've been there. However, I just could not afford to get you a professional makeup artist. Which I'm kind of offended. Well, honey, every day I'm dolled up. Every day. You, you do see the process that I do every day, right? Like, I'm not doing this for nothing. I know what I'm doing. I I know what I'm doing. Every day is prom for me, okay? Every day is church. Every day is a party. A party of life. And I love my life. I sure do. So I'm going to do your makeup today. No, 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 no. You're going to look beautiful, okay? And I really thought this through, okay? I did. I love you. I care about you. I want you to look your absolute best. Better than best. Whatever that is. I want that for you. I do. So, I heard you saying you wanted a pink makeup look. So, I really thought it through. And I picked out a couple looks that I think, oh my goodness, you would look darling. Darling. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. So, I have a couple printouts, okay? I'm trying to be professional for you, okay? I really am. I appreciate me. I appreciate me for once. Sheesh. Well, we got this one right here, okay? This one is absolutely glorious. It is more of a pinky mauve situation. And we obviously have glitter on the eyes. So we have a lot of sparkle going on, and I do love a sparkle. Don't you? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So we do have some slight contouring, okay? We do, we do have some chiseling action happening, which I can, I can provide if need be. We also have some thick brows, okay? They are groomed to utter perfection. And look at these lashes. These lashes are quite Wispy. Yes, they are quite wispy. Wispy. 
and we have some pink glitter, some light reflective pink glitter. And then the shadows are different shades of mauve. And you do see that, right? Her waterline is white to brighten up those eyes. Now the lips, I love the lips, I think. I think they're my favorite, yeah. Uh, I love how frosty they are. You do see that, right? They're quite shiny, but at the same time, they're mad. It's like magic. It's like an oxymoron, right? I love it. Matte, but shiny. Interesting. Beautiful look. And I think you will look fabulous. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. Now, this one is quite different. This is if you want to go natural. Okay, we're talking very soft. And the lashes are quite the standout. In this look. We do have some pink underneath the lash line. And I believe this is like a, a shimmery pink shadow underneath. Quite beautiful. The brows are quite arched. So we, we could do this. Just a quick little blah blah blah. And ta-da. Ta-da. Now we do have a pale pink gloss. And as you can see... She's not really using much bronzer, okay? Which is fine. It's a beautiful look. Less is more. Like, exactly. Less is more. She has a little bit of blush. A slight kiss of blush. But really, it's all about the flawless complexion. Absolutely. Absolutely. She does. She does. She has a slight wing, and I do believe this wing was created by Shadow, not an actual felt tip liner or just regular crayon liner. So I know my stuff. I know my stuff. I don't know about you, but I know my stuff. Okay, this next one right here. Gorgeous. So, I would describe this one as rose gold and champagne, or strawberry champagne. Yeah, strawberry champagne eyes. Here we go. We do have a thick black winged eyeliner here. And we have a pinky nude lip with a little bit of gloss on top. Absolutely, again, pink on the cheeks. Not too much bronzer going on, not too much contour, but we do have a bit of bronzer. We do see a bit of bronzer, yes, yes, yes. But the star of the show is the shadows. We have a little bit of, not necessarily a glitter, but definitely a shimmer. And there, there is, there is a difference. There sure is. So what are you like? You like this one? Oh, that makes me so happy. Okay. Next up, what is this lovely one? This one is quite fun. Now, you are a beautiful, freckled gal. And this lovely girl is also quite freckled. So, we can try to maintain your beautiful complexion and try not to cover up too much. We want to keep a nice glowy complexion. We can even add a couple of freckles or, or no, no, we can just keep it the same. And we have a little bit of highlight, a little bit of highlight on the nose and above the brows here. But I really like this technique with the pink right in, in the upper inner corners, okay? The upper inner corners, okay? Kind of at the top of the nose bridge there. Yes, okay. In the beginning of that crease, we see some pink just blossoming 
really, really nice. And then we have some pink shimmer, okay? And we do have a matching lip, a matching lip. This lip is quite matte, but of course we can always add some lip gloss. No worries. And we have, I believe these are half lashes, quite wispy. Very, very beautiful. And we do have a much more punchier pink, but still a lot pink. But it's a bit more punchier, and we can definitely see it a bit much more. And I will say that this is definitely monochromatic, which I love a good monochromatic look. So there we go. And lastly, but certainly not least, we have this one. I know the image is kind of distorted. Um, I'm so sorry. My apologies, sweetie. Well, you can kind of see what's happening here, right? This is a bit more of a corally pink. Okay, and it's a bit more of a duochrome shadow. Can you see that? It's quite beautiful. I think with your lovely eyes, it definitely would stand out. And then we have a more pinkish red for the lips. And again, we do have some pink blush. But I do feel it's more of like a pinky red yet again. Again, very monochromatic. Yes. So, what do you think? Okay. Okay. You don't want it to be too soft. But you definitely want the pink to shine. Okay. And this is a bit too punchy for you. Too much. Okay. Oh, yes. I am so glad you chose this one because honestly, this is my favorite too. It truly is. It is absolutely gorgeous. Yes. So we are going to recreate this look for you, okay? I'm so excited to be spending some time with you. I tell you what, you kids... You kids don't want to spend any time with your mama, and I just don't understand because I am fun. I don't know about your dad, but I am fun. I am. You just don't know it. You just don't know it. Okay. Well, I hope you will spend more time with me. Is that a promise? Is that a pinky promise? Well, let me grab my things, and I'll be right back. Okay, so as you can see, I have gathered simply the best for the best. <laughs> you can take notes. Absolutely. I'm talking about you're going to need a professional. I am the professional. <laughs> oh my goodness. You can sure like to offend mama. Good thing I don't take it to the heart. I don't. I don't. So, I'm gonna go ahead and refresh your gorgeous face. This is a calming Sika cleansing water. So, can you tell me what's going on with you and Cheryl? You guys are not talking. How do I know? You guys are attached to the hip. Plus, Cheryl's mom did call me. She did. And what really bugs me is that we went half and half. Cheryl's mom and I to get that limo. And now, you can say goodbye to the limo because Cheryl don't like you no more. Now, honestly, I don't need Cheryl's mother calling me. 
I like her enough, but we're not best friends. Okay. Because? Oh, so you can go around just saying because, 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 but you don't ever tell me an explanation. And when I say because, you get mad? <sighs> That's nonsense. If you must know, remember last year at the summer barbecue, she was giving daddy the googly eyes. I don't care if she's got astigmatism. She was giving him googly eyes. Okay, so why did he get the biggest chicken breast then? Honey, I know when someone's giving my man those eyes. And she was. Because when I looked at her, she looked the other way real quick. She got caught out. And after that, I knew she could not be trusted. She could not be trusted. Hmm. Plus, she is quite the talker. Okay, no, there's no problem with someone that likes to talk a lot. There is a problem when someone likes to gossip a lot. Especially when they're gossiping about all the neighbors. Because if they're gossiping about all the neighbors and you're a neighbor, do you think that you're just gonna fly scotch-free? Do you think she's never gonna mention your name to another neighbor? Of course she is. Of course she is. So, not to be trusted. Easy enough. Hmm. But anyways. What is going on with you and Cheryl? Are you going to tell? And who are you even going with? I have so many questions. You're going with Sebastian. Honey, why didn't you ask the grocery boy? You know that he has loved you since the first grade. Mm. He's too much of a good boy. Is that it? Well, that's just sad. That's just sad. I see the way he looks at you. I do. And he is such a great bagger. He likes to organize all of my meats with my breads, with my sweets, with my... Honey. Okay, you don't want to talk about it. Okay, well, let me just... You said that you are going with Sebastian. Does this happen to be the same Sebastian that Cheryl likes? Oh, you, you don't know of such thing. Oh, that's interesting. So you don't, you don't know who your best friend likes? Okay, I just happen to know that Cheryl likes Sebastian. Mm. Interesting. Okay. Oh, it's not the same Sebastian. Oh, okay. How many Sebastians do we have in this county? It's quite a interesting, peculiar name. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay. Of course, I'm not judging you. You're my daughter. However, I will hold you accountable. I sure will. Well, don't you hold everyone accountable? Like your brothers and sisters. <laughs> hmm. I'm just saying what's right is right. Oh, so you both 
I've been in love with Sebastian. In love. We're talking about love now. Interesting. Oh, how the day will have turned. Mm. And how does he feel about you? And he doesn't like Cheryl. He's, he's never liked Cheryl. And he's never mm, gave her any indication. Mm, okay. Well, well, well. I don't, I don't know what to say. I mean, you guys have been friends forever and then some. We never left this block. I, I like to say block. Makes me feel like Jenny. Jenny from the block. Like, a, like I'm hard or something. We never left the block. <laughs> Anyways. You and Cheryl, you just used to run around up and down the block, crazy, crazy girls, without a care, a care in the world. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. I'll stop, but really, I'm, I am serious, though. I am. You know, you don't want to go around messing your relationships up for a boy, okay? Best friends, that is, that's special. That's special. And you guys have been best friends all your life. So, I don't know. Think twice. I, I know you already said yes. You already said yes to the boy. But, um, maybe you and Cheryl can, can talk this through. You know? Maybe make it a one-time thing with Sebastian. Like, he's just your date. You're not making it official or anything. But, uh... Honey, I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life. I'm, I'm really not. I'm just simply here to advise. Okay? Anywho, anywho. So, who's gonna drive you there? Is he a good driver? What car does he drive? Hmm, okay. Okay. Toyotas, Toyotas are reliable. I do love a good Toyota. I do. Is it, is it a pickup truck? Even better. Even better. Okay, well. Let's start out with your complexion, shall we? Let's start with the glow. So, we're going to use the Rare Beauty Illuminating Primer. This is good stuff, honey. This is good stuff. I wish that daddy was here, but he's on another business trip. You know, he's super busy. I may have pumped a little too much. Got a little carried away there. I do tend to mix this with my foundation. Such a beautiful product, but today we are amping up that glow. Yes, we are amping it up. And we're going to use this. This is the Elf Halo Glow. Okay. And a dot here, and a dot here, and a dot here, and a dot here, and a dot d d d there. Okay. Now we're not gonna blend just yet. No, 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 no. Not just. We're not just going willy nilly. We have a process. We have a process. So we're gonna go ahead and use this glossier. Okay. It, this is the foundation. It is the foundation. I know. I'm confusing you. I'm confusing. You. I'm sorry. 
I see a pimple that needs to be popped. To me, that's like winning the lottery. That gives me so much adrenaline. It pumps me up. I, I don't know. Maybe there's something wrong with me, but... <laughs> okay, don't you worry. I'm just gonna take some of this excess foundation. I'm just gonna just blend that out. Don't you worry. Everything is fine. Everything is good. It needed to be done. And did. Now the bumps are flat. The bumps are flat. And that's what we needed. That's what we needed. So now we're gonna go ahead and color correct. And this is a pink color corrector. Light, light, light pink. We're gonna go right here underneath the eyes. Oh yes. And a little bit right here. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. And then, we're not blending just yet, we're going to go ahead and use my beautiful skin radiant concealer from Charlotte Tilbury. Oh, I wish I had an accent like her. I do, I do. Oh man, I wish I had an accent in general. <laughs> okay. Right here, right here, right here, and a little bit right here, and then we're going to go ahead and blend. Yet again, yet again. Okay, I'm taking this blender, beauty blender. Blend, 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 
perfect. Okay. Now we need to go ahead and set because it's quite it's quite creamy under there and we don't want any creases. Creases. They're the worst thing ever. Okay. So let me go ahead and use this easy bake and snatch under your eyes, okay? Let's see. Let me get my powder buff. Okay, look up. And I'm gonna tap, 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 tap. Tap that in. Okay, keep looking up. I'm gonna tap, 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 tap. Tap it in. And then I'm gonna tap a little bit on your chin. Okay, a little bit on the sides of your nose. And that's about it because this is quite stark, okay? We're gonna go in with something a bit more translucent for the rest of your face, but we don't want to lose the glow because why would we pile on the glow and then take it off? It just, it doesn't make sense. But we do need to set because I'm pretty sure it's gonna be really hot where you're going. You're gonna be moving and shaking and grooving. I, I've seen those TikToks. I know you can dance, honey. I know you can dance. I did. I did. Well, one of them made, made it to my For You page. Don't get mad at me. Get mad at TikTok. And for not blocking me. <laughs> okay, well, honey. There we go, a little bit on the forehead. And a little bit on the cupid's bow, you know. Mm -hmm. We don't want that sweat. We don't want that upper lip sweat. Sebastian won't like it. <laughs> okay. That's good, that's good, that's good. Now, we are going move on. Let, let your skin just set for a little bit, you know. I'm going to move on to the eyes. And for that, we have a bunch of Natasha Denona palettes, okay? So, first things first. We want to find a shimmering pink that matches what we're going for. And I don't think that we're going to find it here, but we do have like a matte pink that would be good for the inner corner. Let's see, let's see. This is the Retro palette. That was the Love palette. Um, we can go with Psychedelic, this one right here. That would be really pretty. Or we could go with Glitz. That's really nice, too. Let's see what else. We have the Pastel Palette. Hmm, this is really pretty, but I think that it might be too pink. Might be, let me see. That is really nice. What do you think? Let's swatch the other one that I was thinking about. Okay, so that one is... Dainty. And then we were thinking about psychedelic. Psychedelic. Dainty. Hmm, let's see. Yeah, I think you're right. Let's go with psychedelic. Okay. So, we are going to use. A little something, something on the crease. We're gonna use this nude mauve on the crease. This is just a transition color. Okay, so close your eyes. Very, very good. Very, very good. Okay. And next, let's 
let's go ahead and grab a flat sheer brush. Let's go in with this one. And we're going to dip it into psychedelic. What a name. Okay, so close your eyes. We're going to tap, 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 tap. Keep your eyes closed. Oh, that is so stunning. Open them up. Yeah. Yeah, that was a good choice. That was a good choice. Okay. So, now, I'm just looking at the photo, making sure I get it right, okay? Because I don't want any complaints. I don't. I mean, it's not like you're paying me or anything like that, but, yeah. Uh, let's see. How about we go with tool? I really like this one. Yeah? Okay. So we're actually going to use this pink instead of the ones in the love palette. I think this one might be a bit more delicate, so. Oh, my hair is in my face. It's driving me crazy. Okay, here we go. So a little bit right here in the upper inner corner. And a little bit right here. Amazing. And then we're going to take a small little brush like this, little pencil brush, and we're going to go back, back into this pink psychedelic. And we're going to put this on your lower lashes, okay? So look up. Yeah, lower lash line. Yes, 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 that's it. Which, technically, this is going in, into your lower lashes as well. Whether you like it or not. <laughs> okay. Good. The look is absolutely coming together. So now, we're going to go ahead and focus on your lashes, of course. And I have this funny looking mascara. I love it, though. But we are going to put some falsies, of course. So let's just start out with this as like a base, right? We want the lashes to blend. And I know what you're thinking. What is this? This looks like a weapon, right? Okay. Well, just stay still and you'll be fine, okay? Okay. When I say blink, you blink. 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 just gorgeous. You have so much lashes, to be honest. You probably don't even need falsies, but we'll go the extra mile for you, of course. So, we have our half lashes. I use these all the time, clearly. These are really nice. So, let's go ahead and grab them. Try not to break them, because they are quite fragile. Okay. They're like a delicate hummingbird. Okay, let me just put a little bit of glue. And let's just get it a bit dry, a bit sticky. Bend it a bit. It's all a process. Okay. So, let's put it close your eyes, of course. And we're going to place it and hope for the best. And count to ten. Okay. I don't know why I said count to ten, but we can still count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It is stuck. We did it. Okay. Move on to the next one. And go ahead 
and the glue. Let's go ahead and bend it. Blow it and draw it a bit. Okay. Like we made it malleable enough. And let's place it right here. Okay. Well, lashes are looking fabulous. Okay, now let me go ahead and just pluck your brows. is because I want this look to remain intentionally soft and delicate. You're a pink fairy, okay? So, let's go ahead and delicately fill in your brows. Excellent. Looks so good. And your brows are Lush already, so you didn't really need too much. And then we're gonna fluff them up a little bit with this brow pomade. Okay, and we're gonna brush it up. So that should stay all night. Now, let's add some color to your face. And this look, again, doesn't have too much, you know, contouring. We're not really doing any chiseling. So, we're going to go ahead and just use a glowy bronzer. So, bringing back the glow. And this is from Copesass. It's the... The waves at the sun show bronzer. So let me grab a brush and go ahead and grab this one here. This is quite beautiful. Look at that shade. Okay. It's gonna give you the right amount of color and the right amount of glow and it's going to give you that ultimate healthy lit from within look okay next slide And you know, I know, we don't want to talk about Cheryl again, it's a sensitive topic, but you know that your brother adored her, okay? Wouldn't that be perfect if she was, like, dating your twin? No? Okay, that's a little creepy. I mean, you guys aren't identical or anything like that, obviously, but... Okay, too close to home. Gotcha. But he is such a sweet boy, and I'm not just saying that because he's my son. But look, he's going to prom by himself. Doesn't that make you so sad? No. Okay. So why, why, why does she like him? Because he plays too much video games. 
Well, honey, that's a good thing. I don't know why girls complain about that. At least you know where he is. At all times. He's gonna be in his room. Oh, yeah. Okay, I get it. I'm done. I'm done. I don't mean to nag. I'm just trying to be a problem solver, okay? Anywho, well, let's put on some blush. I'm gonna go ahead and use this Patrick Ta blush in just enough. Just enough. So we're gonna go in with the powder first. Okay. Powder first. And look at that. It is quite big. Patrick, he don't play. He don't play. And then we're gonna top it off with the cream. The creme de la creme. Okay. Did you eat already? Well, I did go ahead and make my famous green bean casserole. Okay, I did order pizza too. I don't know why you guys don't like my green bean casserole. It is perfection. <sighs> okay. You don't know what you're missing. Next up, we're gonna do some highlights. This is, again, from Rare Beauty. And... Let me get a fan brush. Okay. So, tops of the cheekbones. Tops of the cheekbones. The tippy, 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 tippy point of your nose. Your little button nose. And a little bit on the forehead. Do we want to do Chin. I don't know if we want to do the chin, probably not. Let's leave that alone. Yeah, let's leave it alone. No, actually. No, because it looks like our chin is just glowing. Okay. It's beaming. It's beaming. Next, the lips. The lips, and then we're done. And you can go on your merry way. What shoes are you wearing? Okay, where'd you get those? See, Madden? Wow, okay. Even really stepping things up, haven't they? Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and use this. Uh, it's a lip stain. I use them as a lip liner. It's the CoverGirl Outlast lip stain. In the shade in my hair. Okay. Just, you know, relax your lips. You don't have to do one thing crazy. Okay. No, stop. Stop it. You want me to mess up your lips? Okay. Okay. Stay still. Yeah, it's a stain. I don't know how far I need to go convincing you to stay still. My goodness. Are you nervous? You got butterflies and nervous jitters. I don't remember those. I do. Well, I, I still get them with your daddy, of course. I do. I do. And you know, we were high school sweethearts. We were. Okay, so next up, we're going to use this. This is the Anastasia liquid lipstick and catnip catnip cat 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 catnip okay so here we go do not whatever you do do not put your lips together that would be a catastrophe. Okay. 
I do want to put a lip gloss on top because I think a glossy lip is just, it's next level, okay? And lip gloss is in, okay? Lipstick is kind of out, lip gloss is in. And if you're into just, you know, rocking with the trends, I'm just saying... No, I get it. I, I get it. You want to be liked. You want to be loved. You want to follow the trends. You want to be part, just part of things, right? I do get it. I'm just saying that we all don't want to fit the same mold, you know? Sometimes the mold is moldy. Sometimes the mold doesn't fit. You know what I mean? Sometimes the mold is broken. They don't work. So, you need to figure that out, you know? You don't always want to squeeze into the mold. You know? Yeah. You, you get what I'm trying to give. Right? Mm. Okay. So, these are the lip glosses that we have, and I know they all look quite similar, but they're like different shades of pink. We have a lighter shade, we have a, a mid-tone shade, or maybe this one's slightly lighter, I don't know. Yeah, this one's the darkest. This has a little shimmer. Yeah, a little sheen to it. I really like this one. It's from Marc Jacobs. It's the Sugar High Gloss, but honestly, Marc Jacobs doesn't even exist anymore. Bless him, because he makes some of the best things. Truly. Okay. But, uh, no, he still makes his, his perfumes and stuff, just not, not his makeup. Okay. Oh, that looks nice. That really does. This is High Shine. High shine and high color. Okay. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and spray this. So, what are you going to do with your hair? Your sister's going to do something with your hair. Up to, keep it down. A little bit of both. I like it. Okay. Okay, well, when you're finished, we're going to do pictures. Yes, we are. Why do you think I'm wearing a dress? I'm just wearing a dress because cause I want to. I mean, I do want to, but I'm wearing a dress because we are taking family photos. Okay, why do you think all the kids are scrambling about? They're trying to find a cute outfit. <laughs> yeah. We never do family photos. And I know Daddy's not here, but like, at least we can send him some cute stuff, you know? Some cute photos and stuff. Okay. It almost, it's almost like he's here with us. Okay. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Okay. Too much. Okay. I'm sorry. I am sorry. So, I think we have absolutely nailed the look. In fact, I think we did an even better job. I think we did. We did the thing. We did the thing. Let me just do one more thing, though. One more thing. I'm gonna go ahead and just highlight the brow bone. I cannot forget to do that. Now that your skin is a little juicy from that face mist, this will actually be more of an elevated highlight. Let's just get those brow bones. Oh, yes. They are looking like the moonlight. <laughs> the moonlight at night. Okay, so what are the plans? Like, what time are you getting home? Are you sleeping over anybody's house? I need to know all the details. All the details. You need to text me every 15 minutes. Okay, every 30 minutes. Now, every 30 minutes is good. It is. 
Okay. And pictures. I'm gonna need a lot of pictures. And try to fix things with Cheryl. I'm not playing with you. I'm not playing with you. And I don't want her mom calling me. Telling me this, that, your daughter, this, that. I don't want to hear it because then there's going to be problems. And I don't want problems with her. Okay? I haven't even resolved my last problem with her. Her and her googly eyes. So please, whatever you do. Let's try to hug it out. Okay, take your I love you and your sorry. Okay. No, I love you. I do. I do love you. So you finish up. We're going to take some pictures. And then we're going to meet Sebastian. We are. I am. Okay, your siblings don't have to meet him, but I do. I'm just going to ask him some simple questions, okay? Moms have to be the FBI. Actually, we are better than the FBI, okay? It is our job. It is our duty. It's because we love you. I'm so sorry. Get, get ready. Get finished. I love you.